Guys, the club is going to go from the nose to the forehead. Nose to the forehead. I really hope you all are still here. You'd be surprised, right? Thanks for the reassurance. Nose to forehead. <laughs> hey guys, look, I'm actually going to do it, all right? When I do it, you all know what to do. Clap to your screen, throw a baby up in the air. Doesn't have to be yours. I saw a couple out there. Just grab one. Here it is, guys. Nose to forehead on one, two, Now he's good. Are you guys still with me? Say yeah. You guys just saw a little bit of juggling. However, I am a contortionist and an escape artist. The way I like to start my show off is very simple. I said I was going to place my body through this tennis racket, so I'll show you guys how I do it. I'm going to start by placing in my right leg. I'm going to add in both arms, the head. I look at all your lovely reactions and I can tell. Nobody cares. Okay. So guys, I need someone to check this out. Let's make sure it's put together properly. Yeah, check it out, kid. You're doing a great job. Thank you. No, for real. Check it out. Make sure it doesn't pull apart. There's no midgets trapped inside with trap doors. Don't hit that red release button, all right? And when, and when you're done, just pass it around to a few other people, because I want you all to get involved out here tonight. And while you guys check it out, here's the app. Dad. Dad. It's been 12 years, man. Pay attention to me, Dad. I knew I should have bought him those hearing aids back then. Okay, here it is. <laughs> Don't take me too seriously. I'll lose my job. Keep an eye out for my boss, guys, all right? He's wearing a red shirt and black shorts. Here it is. Hands to Are you taking a photo? Yeah. We're going to do January. February. That's a video. This is really awkward. Okay. It's my camera anyway. I just wanted to do the joke. Here it is, guys. Handstand, hat to head. I get 12 tries. And if I do this successfully, you will see me place my body through that racket wherever it went. And if I do get out of the racket, you guys are going to wrap me up in this straight jacket. 30 foot of change. You're going to throw me out of an airplane about 30,000 feet up in the air. I will then disappear. You will suddenly see a parachute fly open. And at that moment, I try to land on top of the five foot unicycle while still inside that jacket, risking my life for your sick entertainment and being a bad influence for all your kids. Are you guys still with me? Say yeah. Yeah. Here it is. Hands down. Hat the head. Sorry if I fart. Get off my stage. This is mine. I worked a long time to get this. How's it going? Thanks for holding up that pole, guys. You look really strong. How's it going? Okay. I'll, I'll do the trick, okay? You guys are looking at me like an Amish guy trying to use an iPad. Either that or a redneck who just found out wrestling was fake. I know, I just found out too. Oh my goodness, everyone look over there, it's Donald Trump. <laughs> oh, it's good, I already built a wall of people. <laughs> hey, don't hate nobody. No, <laughs> okay, all right, I just ruined the show. All right, everyone shut up with politics. Guys, look, let me introduce myself. That way I feel like I'm actually here on a stage and not Cobblestone Street. My name's Daniel Israel. Can everybody make me feel welcome and say what's up? What's up? Thank you, guys. And as I said, I'm going to go all the way through that racket. Where'd it go? I can't do the show without it. Toss it right here. Is your here? That's pretty good, guys. Clap for that guy, all right? We're going all the way through the racket. I'll show you guys once more. We're going to place in my right leg. I'm going to add in both arms. I need this beer for this shirt. I'm just joking, I quit two years ago. Watch, the leg, both arms, and the head. I call this pointless. Thanks for the pity, I appreciate it. Going all the way through. If you guys are with me, everyone say do it. So where do you guys work? Yeah, and you think you get bent out of shape at your job. This is actually a reenactment of me on the day I was born. <laughs> Except I don't have any health insurance. Watch the left shoulder, guys. Wow. That was shoulder one. 
Believe it or not, this is shoulder two. I don't know if you guys can tell just by looking at me, but I've been going through some things recently. Yeah, thanks for laughing that bad. You're helping out my self-esteem, sir, all right? Here it is, guys. Watch my right shoulder, shoulder number two. Number two. Did you guys ever struggle with number two? I know that joke is funny as crap. Thanks, George. Here it is. Watch. That's the first time anyone's ever whistled at me like that. Thank you, sir. Okay, here it is, guys. Uh, I am now halfway through a tennis racket, which is most likely a sentence that you have never heard. So when I let, stand up on my left leg on the count of three, could you guys give me some encouragement? Everybody say you can do it on one, two, three. You can do it! You can do it! One Chipotle. All right. So guys, look, I normally quit eating about three hours before the show, just so I can do this stunt. Right now, I'm so hungry. I could eat that child right over there. Don't worry, guys. The kids are safe, all right? You can trust me. I love kids with ketchup. Uh, do you guys like what you see back here so far? Yeah, yeah, how about now? Okay. Check it out, guys, watch. The last boat before the big finale with the straight jacket and 30-footed chains. For this to work out, I need a little bit of, I need you, man. You're like a big dude. Come on up here. <laughs> don't worry, dude. It's really not that awkward. Just grab that straight jacket for me, all right? And don't kick, kick that light, it's not mine. Okay, I need one more person to help me out. One more person, could you help me out, sir, in the blue? Come on up here. I didn't hear you, kid. Okay. Here, hand me that jacket. Do me a favor, guys. Just hold on to the shoulder that's closest to you. And when you guys are done with that, hold on to that. Look back that way towards the building way back there. Don't look this way towards the moon. Somewhere up there. I don't know. Drop it like it's hot. Not the jacket. The ground is filthy, all right? This is it. Guys, if I get out of this thing, I won't be in this awkward position anymore. <laughs> if I get out of this thing, I can finally say I've made it through everything I need to in life. Look at me. My mom is really proud of me. Probably why she doesn't call me anymore. Tennis balls are in the way. Okay, sir, it's a family show. Okay, <laughs> okay here it is. I'll just get out. One, two, I guess I'll count by myself. Three. Oh yeah, that's about 65% of you. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Everybody clap like this. Everybody, I can see you all clap, clap, clap. You guys hold that. Clap, clap, part like Moses. Good, you read your Bibles. Clap, clap, clap. Everybody, come over here. I'm gonna do something stupid. Watch out, get out of the way. I don't want to knock your drinks. <laughs> I don't know what you all expected. Okay. I'm on the street. Don't go anywhere, guys, all right? Sir, to my left, what's your name? Uh, I'm Brandon. Brandon, did you, did you forget? I did. <laughs> right. I remember my first beat. No, I'm joking. Don't beat me up, sir. Right. Do me a favor, Brandon. Just clip these together behind my back. Hurry up. They're actually going to leave. Doing a great job, man. Don't go anywhere, guys. Stick with me. It's your turn, sir. Your name, your name. Vinny, I wouldn't let you do that. Grab that right there off my leg. Grab it under my leg with your other hand. Vinny, please do not pull. It's not a request, that's a command. All right, thanks. Guys, Vin Vinny's a good sport. Give him a round of applause, all right? Awesome. Uh, what was your name again? Brandon. Awesome. Come on over here, Brandon. Grab the chain right there. Hold that up as high as you can. I think I overspoke, okay? Lay that right there on the back of my neck, Brandon. Try not to knock off the microphone. Vinny, can you grab this end of the chain for me? Vinny, go stand over there in that corner. Think about what you've done. Grab this for me too, Brandon. Brandon, just go stand right over there. Try and look symmetrical. Stop right there, guys, because I'm going to try and stand up on this thing. Uh, actually, Vinny, on the count of three, I want you to pull some over to you. On one, two, three. Yeah, that works, okay. Here it is. I'm going to stand up here because I have a small person complex. Here it is. Part one of my two-part finale. 
You guys are about to witness one strange man to allow two strangers he just met to wrap 30 foot of chain around his neck. If you want to see them do it, say yeah. Yeah! Just to show you guys nobody cares for my safety, all right? <laughs> guys, cross the chain right here in front of me. One of you guys may have to duck. I absolutely love your humility, Benny. Slow down, man. It's around my neck. Don't hurt me, all right? I'm going to walk towards you guys. Cross the chain behind me just like you guys did out in front of me. You guys are doing great. Now stand to my sides, stand to my sides. Pull that chain up so it's snug up against the middle of my back. Because at this point, you guys are going to continue to go around my body, pinning my arms down to my chest as tight as you guys can. Keep going around my body. Do not worry about hurting me. I'm married. Pulling it really tight. As tight as you guys can get it. Just like, okay, you're doing a great job, Brandon. All right, just keep going. Everybody yell tighter. Tighter! By the way, I don't know what's more worse about the show. The fact that two grown men are wrapping me up in a chain on the street. And the fact that you guys are just letting them do it. Okay. Just clip it down to the chain. Uh, clip it down to his part of the chain. Yep. A little bit more. Two more. Two more. You'd be a really good correction officer, Brandon. Clip that one too for me, Vinny. And before you guys leave, uh, stand on my left, Vinny. Stand on my right, Brandon. It's the bad part about having long hair. It looks luscious, but it's in my face when I'm in the straight jacket. Before you leave, I just want to thank you guys so much for what you guys just did to me. I mean that really awkwardly, all right? Thanks. Thanks. Now, guys, look, on the count of three, if you feel like these two guys did a great job tonight, then please give them a huge round of applause on one. We're gonna have a quiz on this, okay? Two, you gotta get a lot louder than that. Three, come on! Thanks. Appreciate you, Brandon. You're awesome. Thank you, guys. How's it going? Excuse me. Follow me to the river. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Thank you. All right. You think I'd pull all this equipment out just to go hurt myself? Now guys, we have to make sure that the chain's really tight. That way you don't think I was working with Brandon or Vinny. Someone to check it out. You need a man's touch. Yeah, you check it out. I said a man's touch here. Pretty tight. Okay. You have anger issues, sir, obviously. Let go, it's mine. Give me a wedgie. Here, you guys check it out, is it tight? It is good. By the way, the dirt won't be there when you get up, all right? One more, one more. Here, you check it out too. Children of the corn. What's your name? What is it? Madeo. Guys, clap for Madeo. He's the highlight of my night. That's why he's wearing that bright jacket. This is it, guys. If I do get out of the chain here on the ground, I attempt to get out of the straight jacket while riding the five-foot unicycle. I know, right? We're going to start a slow beat. Everybody follow my lead. Repeat after this. Wait, hold on. I see a lot of you guys using your feet. Clearly, use your hands. All right, guys? Keep it going, guys. The white people will catch up. Clap, clap, clap. Just like that. I like the energy. Let's try a little bit louder. A little faster, whatever, you know it, just stop. It sounds like a horse race. Stop. Where's State Farm when you need them? Jacob! Jacob! I'm switching to Geico. <laughs> Take a good look at me, guys. I've been doing this now for the past five, maybe even six years. I've only been stuck in the chain about five times each week. So if you guys really want to see me get out, be loud, say yeah. yeah. Now if you could care less, you really just want to see me hurt myself and then go to the bar, say yeah. yeah. I heard way too many kids on that last one, right? But I have gotten really good at this. I've been doing it since I was two. It's called walking. <laughs> Whatever, here it is. Getting out of the chain, the art of dislocation. Contortion. 
stalling. Thank you, sir. When this last link around my neck hits the floor, I get up on the unicycle. Brandon, could you help me out, man? I just need you to grab that unicycle. Vinny, are you still here? Yes. Coming up, man, I need your help. Just hop on that unicycle, Vinny. <laughs> Bring the unicycle right over here, place it right here where my foot is, and stand it up, hold onto it with both hands above the chain. Could you both do that for me? And I need one more guy willing to help you guys out. Could you help me out, sir? What's your name, man? Mike. Mike. Can you guys clap for Mike? Thanks for coming out, Mike. Just stand right there with them. Place a unicycle right there for me, guys. Hold on to it with both hands. I need one guy to stand right here where I'm at. You're fine right there for me, Brandon. And uh, Mike, I'm really sorry. Grab it up where uh, his hand is. <laughs> up as high as you can, just now in the seat. That would be really awkward, all right? Hold it right there. Rotate this right pedal to face down. Good, good. Now rotate this left pedal to face down too. Good, good. All right, you guys, you guys know what you're doing, all right? Haven't been drinking that much. All right, hold it right there. Professionals? Me too, I'm a professional. Boom. Okay, come on over here. Stand right here to my right. That's a pretty tall unicycle, isn't it? Yeah. You're going to do just fine, Nick. <laughs> when I get up there, all you're going to do, you're going to run from back here as fast as you can, all right? You're going to run. You're going to jump off these blocks and do a McTwist and land on my shoulders. Are you ready? <laughs> no. No. Do you know what a McTwist is? No, neither do I. I think it's from McDonald's or something. But look, when I get up there, just grab these blocks. Then you're going to bring them right back here. I need you to go run back to your family, go to college, all right? <laughs> Nick, give me a high five. High five. Awesome, dude. I appreciate you for coming up, man. You didn't have to. You're doing a great job. Guys, clap for him. Let him know you love him. Thanks, dude. These people like you. Don't forget your part. Grab these when I get up there. Run back to your family. Unless you... No, not, not yet. Not yet. Hold on. He doesn't want to be up here. <laughs> let, let go with your left arm. Hold it really tight. Grab him, Nick. Grab him. Yeah, pull him back. Just pull him back, the whole stand. All right. Yeah, that's good. Just take him away. Just kick that back for me, guys. Clap for Nick. Come on, guys. Lean the seat back towards me. Did he take my bars? Yeah. No, put him over there by the thing. He's not nervous. He's just stealing from me. <laughs> All right, hold up. Both hands, guys. Everyone, both hands. If we've had a couple beers, two hands will make the reaction a lot faster. Lead me to the right. My right would be good. <laughs> Lead me backwards an inch. Beer is plural. Okay, here it is. Letting go on the count of three. When you guys let go, just go. When these guys let go, make so much noise. Let everyone know that they just missed a good show. And that they could come watch the finale. Letting go on three, guys. No hesitation. Could you guys give me eye contact? It doesn't create communication, it just makes things weird, right? Thank you, sir. Letting go on three, no hesitation. Thank you, guys. One, two, let go, three! Thanks, man. This is it! This stunt is so dangerous, like Justin Bieber with a set of car keys. Notice my arms are in the jacket. I can't catch myself if I fall. It's kind of possible that I may. So if I do remember three things, nine, one, one. <laughs> that wasn't anything, but did you hear those reactions? Just one of you. The rest of you look really disappointed. Tell me what to do. <laughs> By the way, guys, this is what happens when you get a liberal arts degree. <laughs> I know, I never got one. Okay, watch. You keep talking, but I can't hear you. There's music. <laughs> Let me do the trick first. I'll show you how to get down. I'm crying! 
Everybody you push! Hi, <laughs> <laughs> I can see the head! Man, that's one ugly kid. Put it back! And if you guys want to look me up online, you guys can find me at christianmingle.com. No guys, it's danielisrael.tv, I'm married. But if you guys do want to look me up on social media, guys, please find me on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook at Daniel Israel TV. Daniel Israel TV. And if you guys do follow me on social media, I'll follow you back to your car. Maybe I shouldn't say that because I actually want the followers. That's where I find my identity from your guys' likes. There it is. Hey, you guys walking by, where are you going? You see this every day or something? <laughs> Here it is, guys. <sighs> Are you guys still with me tonight? Say yeah. yeah. Everybody count down all the way from 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Slow it down. Five. You know, you know just, just stop, just stop counting. <laughs> just talk amongst yourselves. Oh my goodness, I hate this part. It's a family show. Hey guys, look, before you all turn around and walk off, if I could leave you all with a thought, we started this show maybe 30 to 35 minutes ago. You guys are still here. That shows a lot of respect towards street theater. I couldn't have done it without you because it would have been really awkward. Uh, did you guys actually have a good time? Guys, this is what I love to do. I like to make people laugh. That's my show. Have a blessed night out here in Vegas. Thank you guys.